Hi guys and welcome back to today's cocktail vlog. Today I'm going to show you how to make a Wisconsin style brandy old fashioned. Thanks to Ty Lee for one of the recent comments uh, in a video, uh, in the Archangel video uh, when I was doing the giveaway. Speaking of which, I'm actually going to do another giveaway in a few days time. I've managed to organize uh, some donated stock from a supplier. So I've got more than one giveaway. I've got multiple things. So make sure you stay tuned over the next three or four days um, and I'll announce in the videos. So the key differences between an old fashioned and a uh, Wisconsin style brandy old fashioned is, well, first of all, obviously it's got brandy in it. It's got brandy in the name. Uh, and then second of all, it does have muddled fruit. So it's got uh, muddled orange and maraschino cherry uh, with the addition of a, a, a soda. So either um, seltzer, you call it in the States, or we call it soda water, um, or like a lemon and lime. There's actually three different uh, ways you can make a brandy old fashioned. There's either a sweet, sour, or a press. Um, I'll leave that up to Ty Lee to explain the difference between between all three because I can't remember that much and I'll, I'll forget, I'll stuff it up. So Ty Lee, if you could input down below and make a comment, that'd be amazing. Uh, so let's get started anyway, I'm, I'm waffling. Uh, we start off with a sugar cube and drop that straight in and then add a few dashes of Angostura bitters. So two generous dashes. I'm just gonna use the muddler just to break down that sugar. Just make it easier once I've actually added the fruit. So add a slice of orange. and a single maraschino cherry. I really love the Luxardo maraschino. These cherries are delicious. They're, they're in this really thick, rich syrup. So I'll actually add a single cherry with a little bit of the um, juice as well. So now, because I've already muddled the, the sugar, I can actually just gently muddle the fruit. And then you're good to add your brandy. So today I'm gonna to be using 23rd Street Distillery. Uh, it's a local distillery based in Renmark, so if you're from Australia, make sure you give it a try. They also make a, a gin, uh, I think it's a rose petal vodka and a few, few other spirits as well. Uh, so measure out a double shot, so 60 mils. And add that straight to your glass. So if you prefer as well, you can also make this in a mixing glass and then you don't retain that uh, muddled fruit in your drink. You can just strain it over fresh ice into your glass. It's completely up to you, obviously. Now, half fill your glass with ice, and then give it a good stir. So much like a standard old fashioned, give it say 25, 30 seconds. Make sure it dilutes, gets nice and cold. Been meaning to try brandy old fashioned for ages, so really appreciate you mentioning it, Tylee. Now top it up with a little bit more ice. And last of all, just a dash of soda. Uh, so refer to the comment below between the different types of soda that you could use. Uh, I'm just gonna uh, use straight soda. I think it's probably gonna be uh, a little sweet as it is because it does have already sugar and a little bit of fruit and obviously that uh, maraschino which is real uh, syrupy. So a small dash, I'm just adding about 10 mils. I'm just gonna give it a gentle stir to mix that soda through. And for garnish, just a slice of orange and a maraschino cherry. So they have a Wisconsin style brandy old fashioned. Cheers. Full on with the brandy. Uh, it's a little bit sweeter obviously because it does have, uh, in addition to just the sugar cube, it does have the uh, maraschino and the, the muddled orange, uh, and as well as that maraschino juice, which is super syrupy, uh, really, really sugary. So just a real sort of subtle uh, spritz to it. Uh, obviously because I only put 10 mils to it. I think, depending on your taste, it might be a little bit too sweet for me if I use like the, um, the lemon and lime soda that they do over there. Um, but it's, it's definitely an interesting take on a, a classic old fashioned. So make sure you give it a try and, and comment below and let me know what you think. So thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you tomorrow for another cocktail video and shortly another giveaway. Cheers.